Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's Professor Williams. I'm just going to real quick um, show you guys how to print um, how to print uh, these quizzes. Um, a couple students had asked, "How do you print these quizzes out?" So this should only take me a minute or so if my computer will cooperate. I'm going to come over here to Exams and Quizzes, and my computer is going to think. And I'm going to go to Chapter Quizzes, and my computer is going to think. And I'm going to just click on chapter quiz one. All right. So what it does is it opens it in a new window. So I want to come up here and I want to maximize that window. And this is where I would click begin my quiz. Um, obviously, this test can be saved. There's no limit. So. There's no kind of menu bar up here, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up here into my browser, and I'm going to go to the print button. And what I do is I want to do print preview. So I want to take a look and see what this thing is going to look like when I print it out. And what I'm going to do is you'll see here <coughs> where I've now got the, the quiz, if I could just go through the next pages. It's just going to flip on through all the way. Now you'll notice that stuff kind of jumps around and I wish that there was something I could do about that but you know I'm just dealing with Blackboard the, the best I can. Um, if I wanted to I could see what it would look like. See now you're going to see where everything is going to going to print out. You may need to to work with little weird stuff like this where you're where your boxes, you know, flip in and out. Um, but this is probably the easiest way to do it. And then I'm just going to come up here. I'm going to hit print document and then just print it from whatever my, my normal printer is. I have another option to go into that quiz. And I could use my cursor and I could select all of the text all the way down. Kind of a pain in the neck, but I could if I wanted to. And I could right click, copy. I could then go to Microsoft Word, place my cursor here, hit the paste key, my computer's going to think. I truly do have the slowest computer on campus. And it's really going to think. But eventually what it's going to give me, I hope, are the, um, uh, is the quiz actually copied into uh, Microsoft Word. Um, then you can manipulate it and change it, you know, however you would, would need to in, um, in Word. So that's your other option. All I can do is just hope for your, your guys' sake that your computer works a lot better than mine. And voila, there it is. And you can see that when it comes through in Word, it comes through with a lot of weird stuff. Um, but at least you can get your question and, you know, your possible answer choices here. So couple of different ways to, to get it done. Um, whichever way you do is certainly up to you, but I hope that this helps, and hope you guys have an awesome day. Thanks.